This is how I'm using ChatGPT to make a business plan in order to raise 1 million rand for my idea. If you are an entrepreneur like myself and have had so many ideas under the sun but have never implemented them because you have never started planning or doing a business plan. When you go to the bank, what do they ask for? When you go to an investor, what do they ask for? They all want well-written and executed business plans. And now with the power of ChatGPT, you can make a business plan in under an hour. Subscribe for more videos. Hello and welcome to this tutorial on how to use ChatGPT to generate you an excellent business plan. Most of us entrepreneurs are stuck at this business plan or anything to do with admin. <laughs> with that being said, let's use the power of ChatGPT to create a business plan. Now I'm going to show you an example of what I did. I don't want to show you the idea, but this is the, my entire business plan that ChatGPT helped me create. The thing that people make the mistake of is not providing ChatGPT with research or your own ideas. They just ask it to create a business plan for a marketing agency and they don't add any of their own research or anything like that. But don't worry, today we are going to show you how to create a business plan. Jump straight to ChatGPT, click on try ChatGPT. If you haven't signed up with an account, go ahead and do so now. The first thing that we're going to do is put in this prompt. Now guys, I will leave this guide on how to create a business plan in the link in the description down below. It will take you to my website and you can download the plan. Go ahead and enter this prompt. You will notice when you watch other ChatGPT videos, they will mention prompts. This is very important because what a lot of people do is they say create a business outline for a business. They don't put in specific prompts which will generate them detailed results. This prompt here has allowed me to create detailed pages for my business plan. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to use this to your advantage. Go ahead and copy this. Put it into a separate page. All right, don't worry about the formatting right now. And now we are going to go back to ChatGPT and tell it about our business. Okay, so this is the type of research or input that you should be putting into chat GPT. This is your experience. You're not making anything up. I want you to ensure that you are adding your own personal touch to chat GPT because it will go a long way. So now that I've added this research, what you need to do is make sure that your prompts are correct. In the beginning, I'm going to say act as a proficient copywriter. You'll see the prompt that I've created. Using this research or my ideas, create an executive summary. And I'll show you exactly what we're going to do with the following points. All right. As you can see, I said act as a copywriter with proficient English and grammar. Create an, and this is what you're going to do. Copy executive summary. Paste it here. Which includes these points here. Then full stop using this information. And what I like to do is I put it in 66 and 99 parentheses, I think. <laughs> quotation marks. That's it. Using this information. Now I have forgotten how much I want to ask for. I am seeking 100,000 Rand. Okay, great. Now that this has been corrected and everything is great, all we do is we click enter. Fantastic. As you can see, it has provided us with a brilliant executive summary. The next mistake that people do is they don't read this. They just copy and paste. Now I'll show you another prompt that you can do. Since we forgot to fill in the business name, we can ask ChatGPT for great business names. I said act as a brand strategist and create 10 brilliant names for our company. Lovely. Now that we have some ideas, what we are going to do when we select an idea for the name for our company, make sure that this name isn't already existing. Okay. I'm going to choose this one here, Bright 
Spark Marketing. And since I'm feeling lazy and I don't want to rewrite this executive summary by filling in the business name, we can actually ask it to do that for us. I've added another prompt here saying using the above executive summary, input our business name, Bright Spark Marketing, and rewrite the executive summary in a non-AI tone. This is another popular prompt that people have discovered. Non-AI tone actually doesn't get picked up by AI detectors. Let's go ahead and enter this prompt. This tool is absolutely insane. The ability to reduce time on tasks such as business plans, which takes forever to create. You can literally make an entire business plan in an hour to three hours. I would say that the more time that you spend on it and refine it, the better it will be. Do not make the mistake, as I've mentioned, of just copying and pasting text. You do have to add your own personal experiences to make a better business plan. So I do not want to go through every single step here. You do get the gist of how to do it. All right, the great part about ChatGPT is we do not have to keep reusing the research that we've put in here or our personal experiences. Reason being is it already knows what we are talking about within this chat. So we can take the prompts that we've already used, such as this one over here, and replace it with the information we wanted to output. Put. So we don't want another executive summary. We now want a market analysis. And this is exactly what I've done for the market analysis. I've used the same prompt, but replaced the information with what we want. And this is what it has given us. Now we can definitely add to it. And in fact, it's actually given us a place to insert market size and projection. But what I'm saying is it cuts out a lot of the admin. It's really a useful guideline for us to use to create our business plan. In fact, it's so powerful, we can use this guideline for financial projections, which is something that a lot of people get stuck on. So let's go ahead and see exactly what they give us for financial projections. Now, this is where the prompt will change. So yes, I do want it to have great English, but... I think that accounting information would be far more useful than copywriting information. So this is what I'm going to replace. Act as a, act as an accountant with proficient English and grammar using South African brands. Now, this is why I say using your own experience or research that you want to input into this will come in very handy because these are just made up figures with no actual meaning behind them. But this is a guideline for how financial projections can look like. So if we put in more information such as we expect to have two clients a month at 10,000 Rand each month, calculate our financial projections based on our assumptions, it will do that for you. If you have no idea what financial projections are or any of these headings here, do not worry. Just go here and say act as an MBA lecturer and teach me how to create financial projections for for my business. Now, do you see what we have just unlocked here? We have unlocked more steps or more guidelines to produce better outputs from ChatGPT. What I mean by this is just exactly how we've done for our business plan. Now, specifically for our financial projection, we can use this guideline to develop a clear and defined financial projection for our business. Remember what I said, add your own input as well and you will get a better out. You go ahead and play around with ChatGPT on your business idea and create a business plan. You're probably not going to get it right on the first try, but by learning how to use this tool and using the right prompts, you can create something that would have taken you two months to create down into a few hours. Don't forget, when you are happy with an output and you copy it, and you want to use it into your plan. Some people just paste it and have this background. Don't do that. You're going to paste without formatting. 
and there you go thank you for watching the video i truly appreciate each and every single one of you i hope that you are using chat gpt the right way learning more about prompts you can definitely check my website i'm posting articles almost every day to help you get started with ai digital marketing anything to do with making money online go check out my website i've made my business plan and i'm going to pitch it to the investor and let's see how it goes with that being said remember to stay shining keep smiling even on a rainy day. Cheers.